So apparently we missed a Soviet Womble video a little while ago. And um, yeah, uh, this is actually one that I was unaware of. This is uh, Space Engineers Patch 01.108 Exploring the Planets update. So, I'm actually unaware of this game in general. Oh, Space Engineers? Yeah. Dude, there's some crazy stuff you can pull in it. Uh, there's actually, uh, like, you can build ships from the ground up. Like, what you do is you pretty much go around space, mine raw materials, and build ships. That's yeah. really what you can do. But there's creative modes as well where people have these ships already pre-built that you can actually put together and it's that you can actually, like, spawn into the world. And it's pretty crazy. Interesting. Could you imagine spawning a Star Destroyer in there? And just uh, going around the universe, and all of a sudden you just go, nah, 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 mm -mm. Well, It looks kind of cool from what I can tell. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Space Engineers is currently nineteen ninety nine on Steam. This video is not sponsored by Space Engineers, but it could be. Yeah, so you want to check out Space Engineers, feel free to. Uh, but for right now, we have uh, this video queued up here, and uh, some Soviet Womble to watch. So let's see what... Uh, Let's see what old Womble Man, the wombliest of Wombles, has to has to say about this. Here we go. Uh, so I'm in space. I've got nothing. Um, oh, oh, oh. I'm in space. Oh. I, see, I see a planet. I see a huge planet. Holy shit. There's another one. There's two. No, it's a moon. It's a moon? It's a, the planet's moon. Did you want to retell moon. the story you just told a moment ago the about the, the three women, or, or did you not feel comfortable on the stream? Yesterday, I had two female Germans join TeamSpeak, and right. they were lovely. So I was like, okay, well, we can play CSGO. So I tried to assemble a team, my dream team. I went, right, I've got to find a fifth. Okay, my fifth, obviously, was tits. Anna, I decided at that wow. time to officially commemorate the beginning of my harem. You because these people <laughs> are now my harem. You absolute motherfucker. From my hard work, you've managed to get three women who didn't have a problem. Might, might I add, they did not have a single problem being your harem. Yeah, they really did. And, and now I kept, you have I kept a calling harem. them my harem, and they were like, okay. I've just got a text from my girlfriend, and I have a feeling it's not a happy <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Space pirates? Yeah, Can I join the space pirates? No, don't join the space pirates. No, you can't join the space pirates. I'm a space pirate. No, fucking come over and... Right, so should we just get over there? We'll get like a ship with a jump drive on it. Why are you 41 <laughs> kilometers away? Oh my god, I'm just gonna jump drive to you. Fuck this. I forgot you can use the clipboard. One second, I'm gonna get my ship. Oh god. Initiating jump drive. Choose Sana's location. <laughs> Oh. Oh, hi, I see you. My ship's called the Pegasus. The, the Pegasus? The ship that I made. That was I weird. When I jumped, the planet didn't change size. Does that mean the planet is so huge that jumping 40 kilometers didn't actually change it? I really want to go see that planet now. Holy shit. They used to fire at a actual right. ship bin. Dude, you're breaking up really badly. Uh, 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 There's a lot of sarcastic uh, interference going on there. So much sarcastic. I can't quite hear you. Over the sarcasm. Will you behave like a fucking adult? I can see you now. I'm on the edge of a ship. Why am I doing a thinking man's pose? What's going on here? What is this? You, what? You just nicked something off the workshop and you strapped the fuck no. over the jet engine. Yes, you fucking no. have. I am an artist. What is that? Is that a smaller ship? This is really cool. Thanks, man. I won't tell about that. You did not do this. He You're did not. No, you liar. didn't, Cyanide. You're a fucking liar. You're a liar, <laughs> Cyanide. See, that one's for you, and that one's for me. Clearly, I've made Clearly. this. There is a level of competence shown in the construction of this craft that indicates you absolutely did not make this craft. I clearly programmed that screen over there. But what's through this door? I know what's through this door. Um, <laughs> oh, yeah. What is through that door? Which is um, the window. Yeah, it's the dead end. Good job. This is the other... Window. The other way. <laughs> Through this door, you will see some um, holes in the floor, and this is my control you, you bay. You have no idea what's down there, do you? Like screens and stuff. Right. See that? Whoa, are we moving? Let me take a seat. Okay, I mean, I mean. So, do you have an my, operational job? My ship. My ship handles what very What the good. hell was that? Oh shit! What have you done? Uh, I may have dis purposely disconnected the two jump pod things at the back. But you just destroyed oh. the server. I didn't destroy the server. Yeah, I'm, I can't see anything like one frame a second. What have you done? Uh. I'm gonna. I have to, I have to, I have to close the space engine. And it won't stop! I've closed space engineers and the noise won't stop. <laughs> 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 right, no more button press. Broke his whole computer. in the ship that you built that you have no idea how it works. In fact, I think we should find my ship. Uh, I, made a, I made a bit of a window. 
What have you done? Don't fucking yeah. poke holes in the we're side fine. of the ship. We're fine. We're fine. It's an access point. Oh! What have you done? Nothing. <laughs> You're fine. Odd noises. <laughs> what was that? What was that? What, was that? <laughs> what did you do, oh, sir? Shit. Sorry, Nate. Sorry. What was that noise? Nothing. Nothing. What did you just do? Nothing. Did you just Nothing. change something? I've decided to give the ship a spiffy rebranding. What have you done? What the hell? It's called the Cyanide Ship, so it's now my ship. What? You've really... Oh, fuck you. Stop fucking around with the doors. <laughs> Can you stop sticking around with the internal doors? Don't mess with the airlock. You're a <laughs> fucking child. Just stop it. <laughs> I mean, sorry, yeah, yeah, thank you very much. I really appreciate the view there, man. Really. It's important, we need it. I it's can't see. The driver can't it's see. You don't need to see, going. you just need to, just need to feel to with your heart. You, you better take a seat because I'm about to hit the jump drive. So impatient. The this is why your ship left you. <laughs> why do you have lights called reactor ambience lights? Moon lights. <laughs> uh, Devastator says we can just blind jump. Do we have to be pointing at the planet in order to do the blind jump? Is that it? So Point the nose of the ship towards the planet before I hit the blind jump button, okay? Initiating yes. jump. Four, um, three... Oh so you about to hyper three. jump into a just planet? Suck. Jump. Everything's black. Is this heaven? Yeah, hang on, I'm just gonna pop outside. Don't move. Mm. Oh! Oh no! <laughs> You're further away from it now. You missed the planet! You're in no position to complain about my accuracy in any first person shoot ever again. You missed a planet. A, an actual planet. Seven kilometer jump. Okay, we're jumping. Three, two, Hang on. one. Nope. McVidia's <laughs> chocolate digestives. <laughs> we don't have any landing gear for, for when we do have to get in there. Yeah, okay. bit of a problem. Yeah, bit of a problem. I'm the captain. This is my ship. What's the name say? The name says what? Cyanide's new ship. So okay. shut up. Right, so it's my what, ship. What? Do you know how to switch to atmospheric thrusters? Uh, no, I do not. No, don't worry. I'm sure we'll work it out. Oh, dude, you're entering fucking re-entry now. There's a fucking artificial horizon. We're about to enter the atmosphere. Yeah, we are, aren't we? Six kilometers and falling very quickly. The jet engines haven't switched on yet. Can you learn to play? What? Why aren't your thrusters? Oh no, no, they are. They're just very gentle. They're spooling up. They're spooling up. And they'll deliver maximum power. Yeah, and so fabulous. I hope it works that way. I can see the ground. It's coming I, very quickly. I can see trees. <laughs> I can see trees. <laughs> trees moving very quickly towards us. See trees? Can you? Oh shit! Oh, oh you lost the engine! Abandoned ship! I'm out! Bye! They're abandoned ship! I'm fucking out of this <laughs> ship! You motherfucker! They're abandoned ship at the last minute! See ya! Enjoy! No, 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 no. 1000 falling very, very quickly now! They're <laughs> not <laughs> Oh god! Quickly, quickly! <laughs> maximum thrust! Maximum thrust! Oh! 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 Oh, oh. oh wow! I'm down! Holy shit! Wow! Okay. The ship's still intact. Uh, I was expecting a bigger boom. So um, now you return to the ship. Those are kind of damaged, though. <laughs> yeah, there's a I'm bit of damage on the back end. So I have to get on one of these planets. Obviously, it's me. I'm magnanimous. Oh. I am on the planet. I'm walking around. Okay, let's pop outside. Okay, I'm just using your doorway to escape. And here's the ground. I told you it was useful. Grass. Wow. Hello. Hello. Wow. <laughs> Holy shit. There's no stopping that. It looks so so unbelievably out of place. That's awesome though. <laughs> so can I actually do anything? Can I like drill into the ground? Oh wow, I can drill into the ground. Dude, look. Huh? Oh shit. Wow! What? Oh my god, you can tunnel on the planet! Are you kidding me? There's resources and everything. Oh my fucking god. Okay, that's kinda cool. So hang on, not only is this planet unbelievably huge, but it's an actual asteroid with resources and shit. Yes. This is amazing! Oh my god, how deep can you dig? Do you reckon you can get to the planet core? Keep going, see what you can find. Wow. So I found um, uranium. Why is there uranium under the ground? Well, where do you think uranium comes from? Well, yeah, but why is it... <laughs> you just there. Stop, stop. Shut, <laughs> shut up, Cyanide. You've already dug yourself into a hole. This is so cool. No, you no, no you asshole. Serious? I should have to tunnel deeper to escape. I have to go out the other side of the planet. Give me like a week and I'll be able to escape. Wow, my god, my mind has been blown by the scale of this planet and the fact that it, it's fully functional. Can we go to a water place? Yeah, so there's a lake nearby. I saw it on, on our planned and totally controlled descent. I'm just going to go into the remote control of the ship. So watch my ship, yeah? It's all still online. If I disable all thrusters, what will happen to the ship? Oh, oh god. Uh oh. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Timber! Oh, oh, oh terraform! The terraform of the ground! Did no, you see that? No way! Oh wait, sorry, I see the lake! You said you wanted to find some water. I gotta go have a look at the water, is that okay? Sure. Okay. You gotta do that. Whee! 
Jesus. <laughs> Jesus wiggling his bum. And... <laughs> Flash. Oh, no, apparently. <laughs> Bounce off the surface of the water. <laughs> it's not water. It's ice. Oh. <laughs> What have you done? Come down here! That was not oh. what I was expecting at all! This isn't as watery as I was expecting from the water. Where are you? Over here, in the lake. Well, lake. Watch out the water. Come see, the water is amazing. The liquid physics are really impressive, man. Seriously. Are you swimming? Yeah, I'm swimming. I want to swim. Come swim. Come swim. Come swim. <laughs> come boy, dude. The water's Watch lovely. Out. I'm coming! Come in, boy! What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Shit! Ice! <laughs> None of it's water! None of it's liquid water, it's all ice! Fucking hell! Oh. You're a fucking asshole! <laughs> Mind the water! Mind the water! I should play more of that, that's pretty good. Yeah, I'd, I'd like to play it. I'd like to see what kind of craziness I can come up with. Uh, it looks kind of similar to um, No Man's Sky. Like, Yeah, that's one thing I was thinking too. Cause one of the only other games I've seen where you can actually go down and land on the surface of a planet that you see, you know. Yeah. No Man's Sky, uh, from what I understand now, it's actually really, really good. I mean, at yeah, least ever I since hear. the No Man's Sky Next update. Yeah. Because, <clears throat> excuse me. Because originally when No Man's Sky launched, it was it felt very empty. It felt like there's going to be uh, Sean Murray, you know, just being like, there's an infinite universe of possibilities, and you're going to be able to do all this. There's going to be space battles. There's going to be, you know, you can run into other players if, if, if it just so happens to happen. One of the things that was disappointing to me about it is when I first started playing, like he was talking about how... Not only are the planets randomly generated, but the life is randomly generated, right? Yes. So it's like you could end up seeing like different creatures on every planet, theoretically. Yes. And yet, on some of the first like six worlds that I explored, all three worlds had carnivorous crab enemies that of different colors that would attack me. Mm. And I was just kind of like, so you're different. telling me that just giant enemy crabs are just a thing in this game? Like apparently that's going to be a constant, despite how random it's supposed to be. Apparently, yes. I don't believe that. Apparently. So, or at least I don't... I don't say... that I, I don't believe that is good RNG and randomization. No, I don't think <laughs> so either. I think, if anything, that's quite a bit bullshit. But, oh eh, well. But supposedly it's a lot better now, so... Oh, yeah, know, which which is good. Which is good. I I might give it a if shot. If you could actually build bit. those ships in that... Yes. Like they, they had there... Yes, That'd you be... can build in uh, in like survival mode, but creative mode is where a lot of people just go ape shit. Either they build would, the ship themselves yeah. with no limits on on uh, like their resource mining and resource management and all that. Uh, but then there's just people who spawn stuff in randomly from the workshop, who spawn in stuff from the workshop. So I would waste a ridiculous amount of time building stuff in that a bit. It sounds a whole lot like me with uh, with uh, seven days to die. Seven days to die. I have effectively turned a overrun encampment where, uh, you know, what called Camp Hope and turned it into a zombie-proof fortress, almost. Nice. What I've done is I've dug a, tr- I've dug a two, uh, two-wide trench and I've put, I've put um, uh, spikes in there so that any time a zombie comes trying to run through, they'll... Effectively, just die on the spikes, and then I also uh, put a uh, walkway on top of the wall so that if uh, you know, I could just go around and snipe and shoot zombies in the head whenever I want to. And then, of course, there's also uh, there's also I have a lot of bullets and a lot of uh, different guns, so I'm very I'm actually doing pretty good right now on oh. Seven Days to Die. I actually haven't played Seven Days to Die in a little while. I want to get back to it again. And also that one time where that bear just randomly came out of nowhere. Not just there was one. There were two. There were two bears in there. And I was just like, <laughs> Jesus. And <laughs> fight the bear, drink for free. That was the that was the explanation behind the whole thing. <laughs> Which is just unbelievable and stupid. So, <laughs> God. 
There's so many good games out there that I'd like to try and everything, but I just don't have the time as much anymore. Yeah. I'd like to. I mean, you know, I'd like to get to it, but we'll see how things go. All right. Well, this was uh, Space Engineers Patch 1.01.108, uh, uh, Exploring the Planets Update by Soviet Womble. If you would like to see more uh, stuff by Soviet Womble, feel free to click the link in the description down below, take you to their original video, so that you can see exactly what, uh, you know, what the Womble Man is all about. I mean, he's got a huge playlist of CSGO, Space Engineers, Alien Isolation, uh, DayZ, uh, and also, um, also Arma 3, and they're all ridiculously hilarious. So I recommend checking all of those out, and um, if you want to check check us out more, uh, you know we have a we have a subscribe button right down there, and also a notification bell if you want to stay notified on whenever our stuff comes out, and um, yeah, if you want to leave a comment or leave a like on the video, we'd greatly appreciate it. And until next time, signing off. I'm Nate. I'm Nick, and we will see you all in the next one. Peace out.